Hey, Vsauce, Michael here. Did you know that you are on a list? That's right. I know you might be thinking, well, gee golly, Mike, me be noticed? Ha! <laughs> yeah, right. But it's true. You see, object permanence is a person's ability to notice that despite not being seen or heard, things continue to exist. This brain function typically begins to develop when a human baby reaches the seven to eight month mark. We all, of course, know that objects exist. I exist, you exist, my car exists. But when you think about that, that also means that a baby could have eyes, but because they don't yet have object permanence to comprehend reflections off a mirror or a photograph taken on your phone, the baby wouldn't know it had eyes. Of course, however, there is more to existence than just objects. What about metaphysical things, like thoughts, feelings, wants, hates, that text message you forgot to reply to, heck, even the internet itself? Things that cannot be seen still very much exist, like all the microscopic life on and inside of you right now. But we also have things like history, science, mathematics, and those things very much exist because we, as human beings, can conceptualize, and that in of itself makes the concepts very real, thereby existing. So, because history exists, that means there is, in concept, a historical annal of everything to ever happen in the universe. Which means that we are all written down on some cosmic list. Our names, who we are, where we live, etc. It's all there. All of it. Everything. You, me, your dog, neighbor, ex, hell, even your bully. And as always, thanks for watching.